Did you ever get injured yourself during this? I broke my nose in preparation just to see how it felt. Now. Hi everyone, I'm Beatrice Verhoeven. I'm a film reporter at The Wrap and I'm here to talk about a movie that has literally traumatized me called Hereditary. And we're here with Alex Wolf, who stars in the film. Thank you so much for joining us. Of course. First of all, what the hell? It's, it's, a, it's a truly disturbing movie on a mm -hmm. kind of visceral level. And I hope that it makes people miserable is the goal. How would you describe the film? Well, I describe it as a uh, pretty intense family drama wrought with uh, conflict that kind of uh, crumbles into a uh, nightmare. It's like the family's guilt, what's going on between the family, all that tumultuous, you know, all those relationships and the friction, it kind of manifests itself in this crazy, horror in this crazy way and it kind of takes everything that maybe you feel like in a family when it's a disaster in your own right. family, it, it takes what you feel and makes it literal and makes it a, a terror and makes it, you know, it's, it's film terrorism as someone mm -hmm. called it. There's obviously one scene where your character really injures himself in the classroom. Mm. Did you ever get injured yourself during this? I broke my nose in preparation just to see how it felt. Now, I, um, <laughs> I said to Ari when that scene was coming up, I said like, hey, I'll do it on a real desk. Like, just letting you know, I'll do that. Just like, tell me. And he was like, I, you know, I love you and thank you, but that is definitely not allowed. Definitely an illegal thing to do. So definitely we're not going to do that. Break your own face. Right, break yeah. my own face. But then he said, okay, we're going to have, we're going to get like a soft cushion desk or whatever. And then I was like, okay, cool, cool. We'll do that. That sounds better. And then I get there and I don't know what I expected, but I expected maybe like a foam desk or something. Yeah. And really it was not that. It had like a foam top or something, but it was hard on the bottom. And there were only two of them. And I had to nail it perfectly. I had to have the blood shoot out perfectly out of my nose and jump back and do that whole thing. And then I remember after, you know, I just was like panting, you know, my voice is gone. Blood is dripping down everywhere. And then blood is gushing down my knee, real blood. Mm -hmm. This one it was real blood gushing down my knee because I slammed it against a chair. I couldn't move my arm. My, my complete ankle was swollen. It looked like a balloon. Oh I was just limping to my trailer and they were like, hey, great job. I was like, thanks guys, I'm gonna go uh, pass out forever. People who say, oh no, horror movies don't scare me. Do you think people will actually like have to re-evaluate re yeah, after for this? for sure. This movie like seeps in your bones. I mean, yes. if, even if you're not, scared, quote unquote, you'll be disturbed or upset by it, for sure. I just don't want to put any more stress on my family.